for the sun. Not only for free because you're not, you know, paying for power, but when you have a power outage and you use the power in your EcoFlow, how do you recharge it? Well, the sun will the sun will be out, and you can charge it with your solar. It's free shipping and handling, and I know that this price this is an investment. Let me just let you know there's different ways to pay for this. You can pay for it with FlexPay. That's using a any major credit card, American Express, MasterCard, Visa, PayPal, debit card, whatever you have. It's five FlexPay. Um, $500 or $520 a month if you get the solar panel. However, if you have an HSN card, we will give you a year and a half to pay off the EcoFlow. It'll be $139 a month for 18 months, $139 a month for even payments if you do not want the solar panel. If you do want the solar panel, it'll just be a couple dollars more than that, not much different. But you're saving, the shipping and handling is $75. Today it's free. So you, it, the savings is just extraordinary on what we're doing today, especially with the solar panel. It's going from $3,349 down to $2,599. Huge savings. So Justin Hyatt is here, our special guest. Come on out here, Justin. You and I have presented several eco flows, yes. but not, I have never presented this one. And have this you and one, I never done it though? I don't think I have. And you know, when I saw the screen, I was look, looking at all the, we call it support like yeah. how long I was like 38 hours for the washing machine like things like I was like wait a minute yeah. this is really a whole house generator you know equivalent it's not like it is. It is. So when, you, <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, I mean, and I'll explain a little bit more about that, but we're showing you some of those things that we're talking about. And that's not even showing you even the times. It's just kind of showing you the, the wattage. You know, this can power up to 3,600 watts of power. So that's like saying like I could do two bench grinders at once, right? Not that you ever would, <laughs> right. but that you could. Um, circular saws and drain cleaners and all of these different things. These are things that are high wattage professional tools. And you your might be washing saying, machine. Your washing machine. That that's that to most of us is is the most powerful tool that we're going <laughs> to use. Yeah, that's it. Is. There it is. The washing is machine. The wa three Here's hours. The three hours of your washing machine. Well, I, I think my loads are like th thirty-seven <laughs> minutes. Yeah, I was going to say. I mean, you could literally. Like, well, I mean, you could do load after could do load the whole of washing. Family's you could do the whole laundry family's laundry with three hours. Your refrigerator. But look the, at how many hours. Thirty-eight hours. Amazing. That's, that's what I was blown away by, 38 yeah. hours of the and, refrigerator. And, and that's kind of like an average. Right. Uh, and I say that because, you know what, with most refrigerators now, they're so efficient that they're going to probably last you even longer than that. Right. We can, we'll, we'll sometimes say get all the way up to possibly three full days on just one full charge from your power station. One of the things that you were talking about, though, Helen, was when you talk about the solar panel, and although we talk about it like, well, it's only $100, but here's the thing about it is that this is a 160 watt solar panel. Typically when we used to do this, it was a 110 watt solar panel. So we've upgraded the solar panel from the 110 watt to 160. When your refrigerator kicks in after your power goes out, your refrigerator's maybe, at most, when that compressor's running is a little over 100 watts. Mm -hmm. That means during the day, your solar panel will be powering up your refrigerator all day. So when you start to now subtract, okay, well, if I can power it all day with the sun, that means only at night then I'd be using the power. So, right, right. so that's why I mean you can literally extend that power beyond. And then this is going off the grid and camping. Now I get it, most of you are saying I may never go camping with this, but off the grid is, look, when you're out of power, it will ultimately feel as though you're off the grid. And full home backup power, this was when we launched it, the very first portable true home backup electric power station like this, a first of its kind. So when you start to do some research on the Delta Pro, what you'll see is, is mm -hmm. that it's not that you're just getting the original Delta Pro, it's that it can be expanded upon as well. So you can actually have this connected to a home panel, which we call it basically our smart home panel, which will connect to your circuit breaker at home and power 10 different circuit breakers in your whole entire house. And then not only that, although this is 3,600 watts, we'll say it's about 3.6 kilowatts, you can expand it all the way up to 25,000 kilowatts of power by adding the extra batteries that we have available as well. So you can grow with this, and of course we're already giving you the kind of like the, the 
the great kickoff with the 160 watt uh, and you're getting all the cables included but this is the most powerful power station that we have we do not have any power stations more powerful no. than this and it's when we say that it's not going to just power 80 percent which is typically what we'll say sometimes we'll say it'll power 90 percent of your home appliances your delta pro is going to power 99 percent of your home appliances. So pretty much just about every single thing that you have in your house. Yeah, and by the way, we do have the solar panels on a two pack. My producer was showing you the item number. You can buy extra solar yes. panels. You also can buy extra batteries. Yeah. So tell us what that is, because I know it's like, and it's almost, it's like $1,800. Is that what this is? Well, so that this is the great thing that we do with EcoFlow, and we're showing you the solar panels, we're showing the extra battery. So here's the thing, with the extra battery, I want you to consider it's double the power, but not double the price. Right. And so what's great about that is, is although we said 38 hours with, with the power station with your Delta Pro, now let's just, right. we'll, we'll round it to 40 to make the math right. a little easier. So now it's 80 hours for your refrigerator. Okay. And you can actually have two additional extra batteries connected to your power station. So then you can have not just 40, 80, then you can have, what's that, 120 right. hours with your, with, that's just your refrigerator. So this will go with you, and then talking about the solar panels, this can accept 1,600 watts of total solar. We're giving you 160 watt. Amazing. Okay. So you can have two extra solar just, panels to go even beyond that. We just did 110 that. watt solar panel. That's what I have. Yeah. I, I have the 110 watt because it, I don't think we even had this when I bought mine. And I will say it's it's really great. And I and anyone who's bought an EcoFlow knows you're not only getting peace of mind, but there's also like a lot of fun things you can do. Like you go camping and you want to, you know, you want to plug in like a, a margarita maker <laughs> or, you know, there's lots of things you could do. This is the most powerful one we have. Now, there's other kinds of generators. You can use a gas generator. Personally, for me, I don't want to have gasoline in the house. There's a lot of safety. So you have to make sure you have it outdoors and away from your house. I lived in a condo for a couple of years. You're not even allowed to have a gas generator. So you, if you live in a condo, yep. you don't really have a choice. So I'm just saying that's the reason we got the EcoFlow initially was we wanted a generator, but you can't get anything but this kind of generator. But this is something that it's not just, oh, well, if you live in this town or or this state or this, everybody needs to have backup power now. Because yeah. sometimes the government will shut off your power because they're trying to save power. I never understood that. We're trying to save power, so we're gonna <laughs> shut the power off. Wait, Thanks what? for paying your monthly bill. <laughs> so we're it's really hot off. and we need to have our fans on right now because yeah. we're so hot, but we don't want the power grid to everything happens. So we're gonna shut the power down. Okay, so you have, you are, you're in control of your power. And, and ultimately that's what it is. It is full control. It's the ultimate in comfort. It means that you've made the decision to be proactive, not reactive, which is often what ends up happening is we think about what's you know we got a storm coming so we're going to go run over to that home right. store and get right. a gas generator and that's only and more specifically for a lot of you who live in a regular conventional home because if you live in an apartment condo you can't own a gas generator you can't Correct. own a propane generator and then after you make that purchase on that gas or propane generator what happens it sits there right until you need it for that next emergency and if it sits there without being used well if the gas was left in it if you need oil you need more gas you need to make sure that you maintain it if you haven't run it in a year those are things that i know a lot of our customers say justin i don't want to even be thinking about it i don't want to deal with that and then so you were just talking about you know if you live in an apartment or condo you say well but my apartment or condo has a generator doesn't it yeah it might but that's for your elevator and that's for your hallway light and so that's not for you. I mean, that, that you need to consider what is your plan. So for me, what I did was I grabbed my Delta Pro when we just had Adalia coming through because I thought, I'm not sure how long we're gonna be out of power for. I wanna make sure that I just have my Delta Pro in the apartment just in case if we're out of power for a day, two days, three days, I'm gonna be set and prepared. I'm gonna be able to run my microwave, my refrigerator, just about every single thing that I have inside of my apartment. I say just about literally everything in my apartment from my Delta Pro. So it's, it's just kind of crossing off your basis of what do I need to power up in my life this is gonna power 99% of your home appliances, so just about everything. And that is also included in one of the things that we don't even show you is all the medical devices. We're showing you even that CPAP machine. What is that on the CPAP? Uh, with my, my brand new glasses, I can't even see this thing. 51 <laughs> it's, and a it's half. About a, a 51 mile and a half away, yeah. not you. <laughs> yeah, what you don't realize is that's why we're actually selling telescopes now. It's to be able to see this, <laughs> the, the, monitors. the monitors now. <laughs> yeah. It's 51 and a half hours for your CPAP machine. One of the oh last power stations that I just did was about eight hours. Yeah. 
This is gonna do it for 51 and a half right. hours. And don't some people always have their um, CPAP machines wired through uh, EcoFlow just in case? So that's one of the great things that we do is that, so it's kind of what we call an emergency power source. So for instance, if you've got your Delta Pro plugged into the wall, and this could be in your bedroom, like because we're talking about the CPAP, and then your CPAP plugged into your Delta Pro, when your apartment, your condo, your house, whatever type of home that you live in loses power, your Delta Pro is gonna automatically turn on mm -hmm. in about 20 milliseconds mm -hmm. and then start to power whatever you got plugged in. So in years past, what we did was we actually had our refrigerator and our fish tank plugged into our Delta Pro. So when we had to evacuate, we knew when the power went mm -hmm. out, which eventually was going to go out, that everything was gonna then just continue to be powered even when we weren't home. And then we were even able to monitor the amount of power on our power station because it has its own Wi-Fi that you can have connected to your app on your phone or tablet and be able to literally monitor the power on the power station from anywhere you are. So there's so many different applications like we were saying that we don't even show you. And then yeah, you know what, we're talking emergency, but it's nice to know that this is something that will be your full home power mm -hmm. And then you can go camping with it yeah, and power and your you whole entire RV. It. By the way, we do have a little cover for it that's specialty. We could take a look in front of Justin. But I also wanted to show you the uh, telescopic handle. I'd yep. love for you to show kind of walking around. I know these are a little bigger and you may want to get them from one spot to the other. That this is doable. You don't have to like lift it up over your head every time you want to move it. Yeah, this is one of the things that's very nice. We added the wheels to this. This is going to be it with the actual weatherproof case. There is a little clear uh, display right here so you can still have access to all of your ports and zippers. There's vents right here. This is something that, you know, if you're purchasing, purchasing this, obviously we talk about this being an investment. Ooh, for an extra I have an 60 update. Bucks, we only can... have 15 left of, of, the, of the protected cases. Really? Yeah. Because uh, well, <laughs> I think what we were seeing was happening was that just about every single one of you was picking it up with <laughs> yeah. the case because, well, why would you not? Uh, it, one, I think it's actually, that's probably the lowest price we've had on the case itself. And it protects your investment for weatherproof, as weatherproof, and of course, uh, just for any dings. This is the little, uh, that kind of telescoping handle. So it's basically power luggage. Yeah. <laughs> okay, you can't take this on the airplane, but it just goes to show you. Right. It makes it very easy and a little bit more portable for you to take around. Um, and it, think about it, you know, when, it is, is 100 pounds. I'm not gonna tell you that it weighs 20 pounds. This is 100 pounds, but the nice part about it is, put it in a central location in your home, and then you can just simply have extension cords, you can leave it in your closet. You don't have to worry about necessarily moving it, but if you do need to move it from room to room, you can just go ahead and take that mm. telescopic handle out and roll it to wherever you need to go. Yeah, I mean, let's take a look yeah. at some of the things that we can power with this pro version of the EcoFlow. Again, this is the most powerful version. Yep. You can get it with the solar panel or without, and honestly, I think that everybody should get the solar panel, because if there is a power outage, how are you going to recharge it? By the way, the EcoFlow, you can recharge it over and over and over again, but if there's no power, then recharging it, you may have to drive somewhere to recharge it. But if you've got the solar panel, just the sun will recharge it for you. Well, right, so again, yeah. that's, so that's full sustainable and independence of power, mm -hmm. having that solar panel. The nice part about having your power stations, though, is that it's just simply one touch of a button, that's it. There's no pull crank, there's no gas, there's no oil. Mm -hmm. You were saying having to drive to a gas station. Yeah. When we launched this, this is the first of its kind that you could actually take to an electric vehicle station and recharge it there in, a, in less than two hours. So there's multitudes of different ways to be able to power this up, but of course we're showing you that display. I never, I never heard that, that you can take so it to- So first of its kind, oh, yes. Oh, okay, because that's new to me. I was like, so you can take it to like a, an electric vehicle ch recharging station and recharge it? So I have, for instance, I've got in my apartment building, I've got EV charging stations um, yeah, that, yeah. Are, that are free to me. Yeah. So I could literally take this to that EV charging station in my apartment garage and and plug it in and recharge it even faster than by just plugging it into the wall. One of the things that's amazing about this one though is I can have this plugged into a generator and my solar panels and have dual input to recharge this even faster. So it takes roughly about three hours for you to be able to charge this up, but that's by plugging it into the wall. Mm -hmm. You can charge it up even faster. And we're not full anti-gasoline. We actually have a little adapter that comes with this that you can have connected to our smart generator and use that to recharge this because it's all about options. If you have a gas or propane generator, great. Use that to recharge your power station 
and then turn off your gas and propane so you can conserve that and then still know that you have the alternatives of solar to be able to recharge it. But again, just the simplicity aspect is we have it on our kitchen island. We're in the studio. Right. And these are things that you just simply can't do if we were presenting a gas generator. We can never turn it on. One touch of a button is all you need to do to turn your power station on. There's no pull crank. We give you all the USB ports that you need to charge your smaller electronics like your phones and your tablets. Fast charge USB-A, regular USB-A, two fast charge USB-C ports. One of the things that happened in Hurricane Sandy was we need to charge our phones. We need to tell people, hey, we're okay. Or we need to contact people to see if they're okay. So knowing that you have that open line of communication for your cell phones and, of course, ultimately entertainment. We know those are important to us. And then, of course, four USB, uh, USB, four three-prong uh, AC outlets right here. And this right here, which is, you'll never see this on any of I our other power say, stations. I was going to say, I don't have that on mine. Do you know mine. what that is? Is that for your washing machine? It is, but do you know what else it's for? <laughs> no. Your RV. Oh, I do not have an RV. That's probably why I didn't know that. Not yet you don't. <laughs> not yet I not don't. Not yet you don't. Who knows <laughs> what exactly. the future holds for me. Uh, but, but yes. You I can, have RV written all over me. <laughs> with that Viking shirt on I you know, do. Right? You're heading up to Duluth to go up to go yeah, up camping. I'm ready. <laughs> 30 amp plug. You can plug your full size RV. And I love that as an example because although a lot of you may not own RVs or, or have a go camping, mm -hmm. that's just an example. Of what's an RV? It's a mobile home. Right. And in that mobile home, you have AC units, you have lighting, you have electric, you've got refrigerators, you've got microwaves, you've got stove top ovens. All those different things can literally be powered by just one power station. So it's the simplicity How of that. How long will it power an RV for? Depends on what you've got running on the RV. If right. you've got your refrigerator and your lights, um, an AC unit, it's all going to depend on those different things. But we're going to show you all those examples right now because I'm going to walk over. I'm going to plug in what we have is we've got a full-size refrigerator. And we show you all the graphics. But the cool thing is that we actually show you in real time what and how long it's going to mm -hmm. power for. Because all of a sudden you're sitting there and you're, we're showing you the presentation. Was it you and I that were on that, that we lose power? We did. We did. During one of our presentations, we literally lost track. It's happening again. It's happening again. This is a this is a created power loss. This we, this we're simulating, but the, <laughs> this, the that that actually happened during our presentation of an EcoFlow. We lost power in the studio during and, a storm. And, and that Helen actually and I happened. looked at, at each other like, <laughs> did you cue did, for that? Did, did we do that? <laughs> did we do that? We actually lost power. We actually lost power. Full size refrigerator and freezer. I forgot about that. <laughs> That's great. Because I, I was thinking about it. I talk about it almost all of the presentations because I was like, you know, the irony of <laughs> the us irony. being out here talking right, about right, it. Right. Full-size refrigerator and freezer. How much food do you have in here? How much medicine do you possibly need to be powered up and kept cool? Right. One of the things that uh, my dad was even talking to me about, he's like, you know what, Justin, it would be interesting is to see all the different medicine that does exist that does need to be cooled. You know, I talk about my sister with her insulin. Yes. And that's certainly something that, There's of course, a lot of other medicines besides There's a lot that. of yeah. other medicine. Yeah. What I do want to show you is keeping the refrigerator door open, it's saying that's not two hours that's two days that it's showing you on the display. That's one of the nice things that we get to do is actually show you in real time how long. Now, most power stations, it's not going to say two days. It might say a day. And the nice thing that we were talking about earlier was you can now expand on that, right? With that extra battery, double the power, not double the price, you can then go ahead and double that from two days to four days just with that extra battery. And all you need to do is just simply daisy chain that one cable Mm -hmm. to your power station and now you've got two days which you, that you can do that with and it's showing you the real-time wattage right here as well it's showing you one day and it's going to show you actually a little bit more than that just for the full day plus refrigerator plus a fan all the different necessities that you might have in life which is light fan to keep yourself cool not mm -hmm. sit in the dark and then all the things that are essentials like food and water and uh, so forth that you need to have power for yeah i mean this is the ego flow Pro. Don't forget that if you have an HSN card, you can take a year and a half to pay it off with no interest. Or if you have any major credit card, you can take five months to pay it off. Um, the shipping and handling on this is free, and I can tell you this is definitely not free. If you take a letter down to the post office, it's not free to ship. You have to put a stamp on it. This weighs 100 pounds. We're going to pay the shipping on it. So that makes it even, you know, just that element of it alone is a huge deal. You choose with the solar panel or without. It's only a hundred dollars difference. And I'll tell you this solar panel, we've got a two pack on sale for, I think it's $500. So they're $250 each. Uh, I mean, on sale, when you get a two pack, you get a hundred dollars. I mean, you get $150 off the sale price. I yep. mean, any way you look at it, it's a 
steal of a deal. I, I would definitely, if you're if you're gonna get this, I would get it with the solar panel, in my opinion. Well, I, and I don't know if we can pull up the, if you went on .com right now, what it would be, or if you already did that, for just the 160 watt, it's well over, I think, $300 for just the 160 watt, if you were to buy it separately. Yeah, I don't, well, we've got a two pack on sale. Those are 160 watts, two pack. That's our best deal, right. is uh, two of them for $500. But that's the sale price, that's what I said. Oh yeah, oh, oh I thought, oh, I'm sorry. I thought you were talking about the one with, if you were actually got the bundle with the solar panel. Oh, then it's only a hundred dollars no, extra. I am. It's only a oh, yeah. hundred dollars difference. Yeah. But if you bought them separately, we do have a two pack separately. Yes. But there's no way anywhere you're going to get that 160 watt solar panel for a hundred dollars. No. That's why I'm really saying that if you are getting this, someday you will want that solar panel to recharge with the sun. Even if you know, oh, I can just take it to a electric charging station where they charge the cars or all sorts of things. There might be a line. Yep. You know, if they're in an emergency, you know, but you're completely autonomous with the sun recharging it. And you can recharge this over and over and over and over again. And so People ask me that all the time. Yeah. Like it's a single use. No, no, no. You only get one charge, <laughs> no, no. you know, and that's it. <laughs> Don't say that. Uh, no. so people worry no, that, that down. That's one of the things that we do yeah. love about the Delta Pro especially is that this is one of the newest batteries that we actually have. So we, in a lot of our original power stations, you could get about, uh, I think it was about 600 life cycles. And the life cycle is basically how many you times were, you can recharge how it. you tell me how many times you can recharge it with this one it's 5,000 to 6,000 recharges that's so that's more what we, than anyone would do in their lifetime and so what we say <laughs> I mean, is that's if you were to do it once a day you could do it for 10 years yeah, like, right. and most of us are not going to do that we're showing you the solar panel one of the things you're talking about having to go to the gas station to get gas but what happens in that emergency is gas is gone and oh. the power, and, and then the I can attest to that. We just had a hurricane come through here. Their, their gas stations are, uh, oh, they're out of gas. People are texting, where are you getting yeah. gas? They're out of gas. Right. That's just in this little area. And then when you watch the news, it says. They tell you which gas well, stations. Well, it's also, they're saying, oh, well, the hurricane missed us. You guys are really lucky the hurricane missed us. Not in my neighborhood. Right. People's whole houses got flooded. Yep. We were out of gas. I mean, there's so many like uh, where we're, people are affected. It doesn't even make it to the news. Right. You uh, know. Well, that's true. You know, although we weren't uh, uh, technically, you know, <laughs> or although we weren't hit by the hurricane, <laughs> right. the amount of flooding that we had. Huge flooding. Imagine being able to power up a sump pump, even though to pump, to pump the water Producers here at HSN, out. Allison, her entire house. Everything flooded. Really, I had yeah. a, I had a few friends that live right on the water, yeah. and they're ha they're having to literally gut, you know, most everything. of everything, right, the, right. all of the drywall, yeah. the baseboards, the flooring. Exactly. So so in those situations, try going to the gas station because right. we couldn't get gas. You can't get out. Of, you can't we even couldn't get out of you our house. You can't get out of your house. I couldn't get out right. of my house during the Adalia. Yep. I, we couldn't go right or left. Yep. Without a paddleboard on the street, yep. and that is true. So you're right, so it's the traveling, yeah. uh, uh, and that could be the flooding, that mm -hmm. could be the down limbs. Of course, you think you're gonna travel to the gas <laughs> station, but if your neighborhood doesn't flooded. have power. It was flooded, you couldn't drive through, it was right. flooded. And what happens if the gas station doesn't have power? <laughs> yeah. So then it's <laughs> like, okay, right. well, what are you gonna do then? No. So, so the other thing is, how much gas can you store? You, right? you, you think, well, we're gonna have enough gas for a day. I don't wanna live day. in a house that's a gas storage unit. That doesn't seem safe to me. You can't you can't legally store, this is what I'm told, you can't legally store gas in your garage because of the earthquakes, the fires. Oh, yeah. Which I was like, when they're saying yeah. that, actually kind of does make sense. My daughter lives in LA. It, you can't. Oh, she just moved in. She just moved. She just How moved did back she to LA. fare with the hurricane? <laughs> it followed her. <laughs> she was fine. She was she fine. Was fine. Okay. She was absolutely fine. Thank you for asking. But yeah, it's uh, it, it's there's so much stuff going on in the country. Everywhere. Is another, in other words, we're yep. we can't talk about somebody in the state without there being some way you're going to lose power. Yeah, exactly. You've got to have power in your control these days. Well, and that's why I always say it's all about alternatives because right. although you have a gas and propane generator at home you know, then just use this as another great alternative. Mm -hmm. We always thought as gas and propane as the only alternatives to being able to have mm -hmm. this type of power. And for the longest time, that was the only alternative. Mm -hmm. Now you have a third alternative, which is our power stations. Mm -hmm. And we have evolved to be more and more powerful. I wanna show you the, the solar panel itself, because remember, this is a 160 watt solar panel. And we talk about the value. The value is unbelievable to just make sure that you, when you get the power station, you get the solar panel as well. But the value goes beyond that, because now, like you were saying, you've got the independence. It's not the residual mm -hmm. payments on mm -hmm. gas that you're gonna have to do every mm -hmm. single time you want to re, you know, repower up your, your gas generator. The, 
the other thing too is, is that when you have this connected to your power station, now it's not just a power station, it's a solar generator. And what I mean by that is that this solar panel is gonna convert the sun's rays into electricity and power, power through the solar panel, and then power through your power station to whatever you got plugged in. Meaning whatever you've got plugged in to your power station while you're using your solar panels, are, it's not depleting the power from your power station. <laughs> it's using and running for free, infinitely, from the sun. So that's one of the great aspects of making sure that when you do pick this up, and why 90 plus percent of you pick it up with the solar panel, is that, well, I've got it to recharge it, and two, I've got it to be able to power up all my devices during the day, and that will prolong the power that I have on my power station station as well. Yeah, exactly. And you know, there's lots of fun ways to use this as well. Talking about camping and RVing, or even if you want to have like a, the you know, little kids are going to, you know, camp in the backyard and they yeah. want to have like a little light and play music and maybe have like a little portable TV or something. It's a, you it's could a, have a blow up uh, uh, bounce house yes. pa literally powered right? with your, your Delta Pro. Yeah, exactly. Cause you know, you don't have a plug in the, in the grass in the middle of your lawn, you know, and then, but now you do, you've got power anywhere you want it whenever you want it, regardless of what's going on with the power grid that's out of your control. And that, it, everything in life seems to be always out of our mm -hmm. control. One thing that you can control yeah. is, of course, making the decision of what is going to be your backup. It's not a matter of if, it's not a, it's a matter of when. That's one of the things I always say because it so, rings so true is that you not only don't know when you're going to be out of power, you also don't know how long you're going to be out of power for. Probably and the enough. other thing, too, is, you know, it's, we've showed you a refrigerator, we've showed you a light, we showed you a fan. I want to show you the high wattage appliances now, too. That's your air fryer, that's your blow dryer, that's your hot plate, that's your full size microwave. I'm going to set this to just, um, let's just set it to 25 seconds right here. Hit start. And I want you to see, this is going to power up your full-size microwave while it's still powering up my light and my fan. We have two hours with the refrigerator light and our fan. It's showing you about 1,800 watts in real time. You're getting to see all this information in real time. You can't do that with your gas generator or propane generator. You won't have an LCD display on your gas or propane generator. And so it's nice to know that in those types of emergencies, when I was saying, well, which one did I grab? I yeah. grabbed my Delta Max. I grabbed my Delta Pro and I had some of my small, and I had the uh, the River 600 Pro because I just wanted to make sure I had, so I kind of prioritized, mm -hmm. right? I got my Delta Pro for my larger appliances and I've right. got some of my smaller power stations for some of my smaller ones. So I see you've got like a portable AC unit yes. here because that's the kind of thing. I mean, here in Florida, the heat, and I know Texas yep. and lots of other, a matter of fact, it seems like there's a lot of other uh, states that are having like such awful heat, like Arizona. Imagine if there's a power outage and the heat, that's, that's going to be like unsafe if you can't power it. Well, so heat is actually one of the most deadly weather events. Heat. We, we don't, I don't think we think of it that way, mm -hmm. but it really is. I mean, it can get very dangerous because when it's 100 degrees outside, mm -hmm. which here it's like 100 plus, <laughs> yeah. it's all of a sudden way more than 100 degrees inside. So it's nice to know that if you live in a particular home that maybe has portable AC units or has, for instance, window AC units, we're going to simply go ahead and plug it right here. It's that full three-prong AC outlet. We just turn that AC on right here. And then in a second, we're going to get power to our full-size portable AC unit. So You're yeah, getting air conditioning. You're getting when air conditioning. everybody has got their power out, you've got a, an air conditioner. And one of the things that we were seeing in California was they were having the rolling blackouts and doing it purposely, turning off the power right. grid, because everybody was running their AC units. Because it was hot. Because it was hot. So <laughs> let's turn off the power when it's hot. <laughs> yeah, right. Doesn't make any sense. No, it doesn't make any sense. So right. you have to think about, you know, taking care of you and your family, making sure everybody's safe and can survive all of these incredible weather, weather events that are happening. Yeah. What about when it's really cold? What can we do then, Justin? Well, uh, I'm going to show you in a second. We can do your heating blanket. I don't know if we can. I want to show you exactly how long you can actually, here, I'll give you a better angle right there. 19 hours on that portable AC unit. That's, That's almost enough a, to get a good night's sleep. That, <laughs> my friend has no AC in his apartment. It keeps going out and he keeps calling his landlord. He's like, Justin, I just can't take it anymore. So I was like, I have an extra portable AC unit and I've got another power station here. You guys can have this for the day. Cause he was like, I just, it's, it's just killing me. Cause it, uh, you know, he's a big dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's six, he's six four and uh, a big dude. <laughs> and he's a big guy. We don't have to say his weight on TV. <laughs> I wasn't going to call him that. <laughs> don't call, don't call I him I love you, Keith. Yeah. Uh, but you know what? But he's like, Justin, it's like, I'm, I'm just sitting yeah. in this hot house. It's, it's, it, it, it's, it's brutal. It's bad for you. It's bad for your mental health. It's bad for everything. So it's not even that he's health. out of power. Right. So think about all the different ways that you can use it. So now yeah. you're talking about, okay, well, what about when it's not summertime? Eventually it's going to be winter. 
winter time. How are we gonna stay warm? I've got a heating blanket right back here. And this, the reason why I show you a heating blanket instead of a space heater, and I know a lot of you think, well, the best way to stay warm is gonna be with my space heater, but really the best way to stay warm is gonna be with, I'm gonna set it all the way down so maybe it'll be easier for you guys to pick that up. The best way to stay warm is, in most efficient way, is gonna be with your heating blanket. That heating blanket's gonna show you, it's gonna kinda jump up and down. You can see like the wattage is kinda jumping up and down, but you should get roughly about a full day with your heating blanket. If you got 10 extra hours to stay warm yeah. when it's a winter storm, wouldn't you take it? What about if it was 15 hours? Mm -hmm. How about nearly 24 hours with your heating blanket that you know a full day that you can stay warm? And then that might give you enough time to say, okay, well, we've got the gas generator or we've got, we can go to somebody else's home and recharge it there. Or, oh, by the way, we've got our solar panels that we can use to recharge our, uh, our heating blanket. Or during the day, if the sun is out, because I know how it is in Minnesota, when it looks <laughs> When it looks like it's gorgeous out, there's not a cloud in the sky, yes. you think, oh, wow, that looks pretty. And you step outside and it's 30 below, <laughs> yeah. right? I mean, that's usually when it happens. You can have your solar panel out during the day right? and be powering up your, your heating blanket with your solar panel. Or if you're considering getting the extra solar panels, which I know has been very popular, well, you'll have plenty of power, free, infinite power during the day to power all these. You could literally be powering your AC unit all day right, because it's 160 watt, this wasn't even 160 watts, you can be powering this all day. And then at night, all you're doing is running, that's eight hours that you're not running it off of solar. So think about how long you've just now extended your power on your power station. Yeah, and every single time we present this product, it is popular, 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 the EcoFlow. This particular presentation and sale price, I, is the most powerful pro that we've ever done. So if, you're, if you want to go and get the most powerful EcoFlow, the Delta Pro, th today is the day. This is the moment. We have an amazing deal. We have a year and a half to pay it off if you use your HSN card. You can get it with the solar panel or without. The difference is only $100 difference getting the solar panel. We also have a case, a custom case available. Pat, how many are left? Nine. <laughs> okay, nine. Sadly, we only have nine. Uh, so I will show you the custom case. I think what's happening is a lot of people, I mean, honestly, w w only, you know, I know that people aren't buying 75 of these at once. You know, you, you, it's, a, it's an investment, somebody buys one, but most people that are buying them are getting this custom case, and this is gonna protect it from the weather, and we only have nine cases left. If you already own the Delta Pro, you can get one of those cases. It is on sale, I think it's $30 off, right, Pat? I was going to say, I think it's yeah, typically no, it's just $30 over $100. Off. It's $99 usually. It's $69 yeah. right now, so it's $30 on sale this case. So I just wanted to show it to you. And I did want to show you this telescopic handle here so you can take your um, Delta Pro and, you know, kind of move around with it. I wanted to, you know, kind of show you this. You know, it's not like I'm doing this with one hand. It's 100 pounds. Could I lift it up? No. But can I wheel it around? Um, absolutely no problem. So I wanted to show that to you. Um, we're doing a year and a half to pay it off with the HSN card. So if you don't have an HSN card, you can apply. If you're approved, we even take $10 off a, a coupon. That's what we're doing today. But you can go to hsn.com, put an HSN card in the search, or call the 800 number, 1-800-695-1418. And you get something called VIP financing. It's a year and a half to pay off your Delta EcoFlow for no interest, there's no interest, but make sure you pay it off before the 18 months is over with to get no interest. With solar is $24.99.99. Um, I mean, without solar, with solar is $25.99.99. So you can see it's only $100 difference. Um, for example, if you take a year and a half to pay it off, I did the math, it's only $139 a month without solar. With solar, it's just a couple dollars more than that, not literally just a couple dollars more. Uh, flex pay, five months to pay it off on any major credit card. Maybe you don't want to open up an HSN card. You already have an American Express, a Visa, PayPal, debit card, whatever you have. $500 a month for five months or $520 a month for five months to get the solar panel. So I know we're halfway through the presentation. We've got uh, so, much, so much more to tell you about this, but when I think about what is going on in the country with weather, uh, you know, I've lived in New York, 
I lived in upstate New York. I lived in New York City. I've lived in LA. I lived in LA for 15 years. I've lived in Florida now for 15 years. So I've, I've experienced an earthquake. I've experienced a hurricane. I'm very lucky. I've experienced blizzards, whiteout conditions, snowstorms. I know what it's like to be in ex extreme weather events coupled with no power. It's kind of the worst possible time to have no power, but that's usually why you lose power is because there's extreme weather. There is more extreme weather going on now than any, any time in, you know, every time I turn on the news, 100 year uh, record for the, the you know, yeah. the, the, you know, it's not like- Highest oh, July on record. Right, highest July on record. You know, and, and, it's, and it's, it's really these emergency situations where you want to be prepared before the situation. Because trust me, when you're in the situation, you can't even get out of your house to go to the big box store to buy a generator. Yeah. You can't, it's too late then. It's honestly, it's too late. You need to be prepared before. And as long as you have it in your house, you can use it for lots of fun things like camping and RVing and, and having, you know, plug in a bouncy house. I love, you know, that idea. Things where like, oh, I wish I had power in the middle of this field and we could do like a giant movie and have a party with music. And you certainly could do whatever you want. You're going camping, you can, you know, a plug in, um, you know, like a fan and you can glamp, which would be the only way you'd see me camping. So I just wanted to, you know, there's, you know, you get to use it all the time, but this is really extraordinary, this deal that we're having. And Justin, how many shows do you have today? This is the only one that we got today. Uh, this was actually dropped in last minute, and, it, and that's kind of what's been happening is just because we've seen such a high demand, obviously, we talk about just weather events recently, the weather events that are, we know are eventually going to happen in the future, that's one of the things that's <laughs> nice about investing in the Delta Pro is that this is something that, that's got a five-year warranty. This is something that we say not has 500 life cycles, has 6,000 life cycles. That's about a 10-year lifespan that you don't have to even think about it. I've got the CPAP machine plugged in. You're looking at two days. That's 48 hours with your CPAP machine. So uh, I think we just wanted to make sure that well, a lot of you, when you're saying, when we talk about investments, are we, if we're going to do it, we want to do it the right way. And a lot of you say, well, we want to make sure that if we're going to invest it, we want to make sure that we get the most powerful. The Delta Pro is the most powerful that we have. This is going to power 99% of your home appliances. What is that? That's your washing machine. That's your microwave. That's your air fryer. That's just about every single thing that you have in your house right now. I, I can't think of anything in my apartment that I can't use. And we're showing you right now. That's your laptops. That's your drills. That's your power tools your oxygen machine, your dialysis machine, maybe you need to recharge any of your motor, your, your electric scooters, whatever it might be, this is gonna power it up. You're not gonna be in a dark home, you won't be in a hot home, and you're gonna know that it's so easy and manageable to use. This isn't something that you're intimidated by and there's nothing to fear because it's just one touch of a button and it's silent. The loudest thing right here is the CPAP machine. <laughs> I mean, the CPAP machine is louder than the power station that is powering it up. So knowing you can use it inside your house, in your bedroom, you can have a little uh, refrigerator. And of course, the idea of tailgating, I know you're, you're showing the, the Vikings, probably would be nice if I'm tailgating. I know this was me. You know, talking about glamping. If I'm tailgating, I'm, gonna, I'm the guy with the Delta Pro and the heating blanket wrapped <laughs> around me at the Minnesota Viking tailgating games uh, to make sure I stay warm. So all the different aspects and different ways that you can use this. Yeah, and there's lots of different ways. And I know, I don't want to be like all doom and gloom that you're going to use it, but that's kind of why you have emergency power well, is just, you know, just in, in case in case of an emergency where you lose power and you need to have power for necessities like refrigerating medicine, your CPAP machine, uh, cooking, you, you know, even like you have a hot plate, you boil water, you could survive. I mean, I have emergency meals that I got, you know, 25 year emergency meals that we sold here at HSN. I, I own them. You know, one of the things you need is you need to add water. You can certainly add cold water, but it's going to taste way better if you can add boiling water. I mean, and you're able to, you know, plug in your hot plate. I mean, this is a, a, the top of the line, the best of the best, the most powerful that we we've ever done and the price is extraordinary how much you're saving you're saving $500 off the with solar and even without solar and even more with the solar with the solar you're saving so much more it is an extraordinary that's two it's $550 you're saving so we're we've never done this price before 
This was added to the show, like Justin said, because people are calling in and asking, well, so what we like to do is we like to bring the price down. We like to give you an easy way to pay it off with your HSN card, no annual fee. It's a free credit card. You can get it in two seconds by going to hsn.com or calling the number on your screen. We'll get to the right place, but you have a year and a half to pay it off. We're gonna take a teeny little break. And when we come back, we're gonna go through the whole presentation again for the only presentation of the day for the EcoFlow Delta Pro. As a chef, cooking is not only my job, it's a passion. And I know the importance of having the right tools. Enter Kitchen HQ. From high performance cookware to time saving gadgets, Kitchen HQ tools are designed to make cooking easier, faster, and more enjoyable for cooks at all levels. And they're affordably priced. Kitchen HQ can help you master any meal exclusively at HSN. Worry about one less thing with our Protection Plus plans at HSN. Electronics, fitness equipment, even jewelry can be covered. Shop smarts and protect your purchase. It's easy to add when you're checking out. Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. Everything we do is intended to be unlike any other company of our kind. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing because information is the key to being a healthy person. We're making bigger, even better with our supersize values, and they're available only at HSN. Supersize values are based on the price per ounce of the same item in a smaller size. However, they do not reflect a price at which HSN would sell the item. Have questions? Call us at 1-800-284-3900. for watching HSN. My name is Helen Keeney. I'm here with Justin Hyatt, and we have a very special show that is only one time today. We got a small quantity of the EcoFlow Delta. So we decided to do a big price drop, $550 off. We decided to ship it to you for free. It is not free to ship a 100-pound generator, but we're shipping it for free. And also, we're giving you a year and a half to pay it off with HSN's um, own proprietary credit card. By the way, if you have a QVC credit card called the Q card, you can also use that. It's our sister network, and we take their credit card as well. So we have a choice of the Pro Delta, Delta Pro without the solar panel, or with the solar panel. And let me kind of pop over here. This is a 160 watt solar panel. So when you use your EcoFlow, let's say you use it and you've got all the power out of it, you've powered your refrigerator, your washing machine, your television, your, your um, Wi-Fi, everything. And then you're like, uh-oh, I want to watch the end of the movie and I want to have my you know, food still be cold. You can plug it into your solar panel and it'll immediately continue to charge all those items as it's charging your ego flow. So you won't miss a beat as it's recharging. You'll still be able to recharge and use power in it with the solar panel. That's why I really recommend you get the solar panel. I personally got it with the solar panel. I have a much smaller, less powerful EcoFlow. This one, when it launched, was almost $4,000. Yeah. So this is the lowest price we've ever had the EcoFlow uh, Pro before, right, Justin? Yeah, we were at $3,600 when we originally launched this. And at the time, it's cutting edge and still continues to be cutting edge. And it's still, to this day, the most powerful power station that we offer, not just here at HSN, that we offer at EcoFlow. And when we originally launched it, it was award-winning. It had broken barriers as, far as being the first ever of its kind that you can take to an EV station. And it was the first of its kind that was portable, yet still home backup power. And that's one of the yeah. things that we love about this is that, you know, you can still power up so many different things. We're actually showing you the, the, um, the old, looks like the old original Delta, which is actually good because you know what? I love this because that's what we launched with. We launched with the original Delta and that was the 1300. This is 3,600 watts 
yeah. of power. Yeah. 3,600 watts, nearly triple the amount of wattage. And so you can be able to power literally your whole entire house with this power station. Not the one we're showing you in this video, but we can show you, um, and there's other videos I actually hope that we can find because what you can do with this is literally have it connected to your house and powering up everything in inside of your home. Like this truly is in place of a gas generator. And that's one of the things I was gonna get to is that you know when we say 3,600 watts of power, that is directly uh, comparable to your gas mm. and propane generator. The things that are not comparable is that this doesn't run off of gas, that this doesn't run mm -hmm. off of oil, this just doesn't run off of propane, this doesn't right. have exhaust. You can run this inside. It's completely silent. Yeah, you can run this inside safely. Safely. Do not run your gas generator inside safely, but EcoFlow also does have products that have a gas hybrid to it. So that's the other thing, is that this actually, and we're showing you right there, that's that video I wanted to show you, that you can actually have multiple connectors and eventually in this video, it's going to show you the gas generator that we do too. There's actually a dual fuel generator that we have, which is a propane and gas generator. We're not anti-gas or propane. We're pro-alternatives. Alternatives, right. And that's the thing that we really stress is that this is about having options, being able to know yeah. that, you know, hey, look, in emergency, we may run out of gas and we won't be able to power up that gas generator. And we won't be able to get more gas to power up that gas generator. So what are you gonna do? That's why it's nice to know that you do have the alternative. You're talking about the, that hybrid. This little adapter, when you pick, the, pick it up, when you get this at home, this adapter is for your smart generator. So that's what this is actually for. This is for your dual fuel or your regular uh, gas generator that, that we do have available. Is that extra or? This adapter comes included. Oh, comes included. So, so yeah, so all you need to do, and one of the things that's amazing is, you know, your Delta Pro runs off of Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. It doesn't run off of, but it has Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. So you can have uh, in your app, you can literally have your smart generator when it's connected to your Delta Pro. When it gets down to, for instance, your Delta Pro gets down to 20%, your gas generator, your hybrid generator will automatically turn on all on its own, power it up to 100%, and then automatically turn off creating a full autonomous system. And the other thing that's really amazing is that we have a dual input, meaning that you can have your gas generator charging your power station up while simultaneously having your solar panels charging it up, charging it even faster. Yeah, oh, yeah. I mean, this the technology is amazing. By the way, let me show you one more thing. I'm going to pop over here. Um, if you're picking this up, and I think almost everybody who's bought this today is adding to their order, yeah. $30 off of the custom case that weather protects it. Four left. Oh, my goodness. I shouldn't even talk about it. It's $30 off. There's only four left of the um, EcoFlow case that is the, the custom case for the Pro. There's only four of them. So completely. <laughs> oh Goodness. So the, it makes it weatherproof. It actually gives you a little bit more handles. If you're just picking it up, if you've already purchased it, I just want to show you a little bit more about it. I'm just going to tilt it down so you guys can see. You still have uh, access to that full display. You still have access to the full panel right here as well. So I can actually go ahead and open this up, for instance, and still be able to have access to all of my ports right here in the very front. So I can go ahead and turn that power station on and just simply you'll see the display turn on, on uh, underneath the, the uh, little window right here and then it still does have all of its vents on the side as well so it makes it really easy and nice to use and of course like you were saying ultimately it's a great way to just kind of protect your yeah. investment i wanted to mention that i didn't realize there's only four left so i love that that is, is the smallest <laughs> counter i've i have maybe like, have ever seen in the 10 years four. i've been here four left <laughs> four we've left. never shown that before. yeah and by the way if you want to buy extra solar panels yeah. we also have a special where you get a two pack of the 160 watt for 499.99 and and that will will that go with all of the eco flows it, if you already have an eco flow it, it will and that's the that's the nice thing is that so you know you're getting the 160 watt Watt included with your Delta Pro, you can use that if you have any other power any other power stations. You can use oh, okay. this solar panel with all of your other ones. We're showing you the two pack. Yeah, that's item number eight two one one zero nine. It's four ninety nine ninety nine, and that is on sale. That is on sale, and one of the great things about that is that you know when we had the hundred and ten watt, the hundred and ten yeah. watt solar panel, one of them used <laughs> to be three hundred dollars. Right, and that's the one I have is the hundred and ten watt. And honestly, um, I th I bought mine a while ago, my EcoFlow with the solar panel. 
and the price was, I mean, it, it was it was a lot more because this price has really gone down. Like the you're saving seven hundred and fifty dollars today during this presentation that we just decided during the day we were going to do a one hour show and that's it all day nothing else before or after. If you get your EcoFlow Delta Pro with the solar panel, it's seven hundred and fifty dollars off for my show. Seven hundred and fifty dollars off. If you want to get it without the solar panel, it's $550 off. So you're saving, you know, $750 you're saving. It's like getting all, all I mean, it's $500 for two solar panels. You can, you know, with the savings, grab an, a couple extra solar panels. I mean, it really is extraordinary. But why do we need to have backup power, Justin? Well, why? I can tell me why. Well, I'll tell you why. <laughs> it's if, a you've, if you've ever been out of power, you yeah. know that gut wrenching feeling of. Yeah. We did. We're not prepared. Justin and I had that experience <laughs> during, a during a presentation of an EcoFlow. We were on air together, and HSN lost its power because we're in Florida. There was a electricity, you know, and like we a were lightning strike. Oblivious. We thought maybe it was like a set, like a kind of can a theatrical. Can we do it real quick? Yeah. Can we, do, <laughs> can we pretend? Because we literally, we have. We love being able to do this because this is true. When you hear it. When you hear that thunder that all of a sudden hits through that sound and yes. the lightning that flickers and all of a sudden... And there goes the power. <laughs> this happened to us in real time. In real time. We thought they were pretending yeah. like we're doing now. This yeah. is a pretend but power But it looked outage. just like this. It looked exactly like this. Which like we were like, wow, And we I were guess like, wow, they're good. The lighting guys are really good. <laughs> the they lighting did a guys great are good. job. It's and they're like, this. nope, we actually lost power. It was very ironic. <laughs> it, it was ironic. Um, but why ultimately? Because there is nothing worse, especially if you're truly dependent on power, mm -hmm. being out of power. And oh, there's yeah. nothing worse it's than scary. saying- It's scary. It is. It's, you know, look, I've, I've been through many hurricanes. Oh. I grew up in Miami. So I actually went through Hurricane Andrew. Oh, I can really? still remember as a kid, us huddled up in the bathroom, in the tub, at, as Hurricane Andrew was going over us. Oh my gosh, We had I didn't the radio. That. I remember, you know, my, you know my, my parents were very young. I remember opening the refrigerator and there were slices of, you know, Kraft cheese. <laughs> okay. Um, and I'm not exaggerating. You know, it was, it, it, that's a scary thing and that's a memory that has lasted forever with me. But how many hurricanes have I been through since? We were out of, hurric we were out of power for two weeks at one time. Mm -hmm. And we were going to the car to recharge our cell phones. We couldn't, we had no way of, outside of having a gas generator, but guess what? You say, well, yeah, but I've got a gas generator. You're not prepared for two weeks of being out of power. <laughs> yeah, right. Okay. That's why I say, how much gas can you yeah, right. store? That's why you need a solar panel. That's the amazing part about right. having your solar panel is mm -hmm. that it's you, the unknowns. You don't know when you're going to go be out of power, and you don't know how long you're going to be out of power for. And that's what that's where this fills in. And that's mm -hmm. why when we show you, like, why do you want the two extra solar panels? Because the more solar that you have the faster you can recharge your power station. And then the best part of, of that is, is that now you've got, what is that? Three, let's say you just have two solar panels, right? That's 300, 320, mm -hmm. 320 watts. 320 watts that you're using, that's, that's 320 watts of sun power, right? That's just like we have got wind power, now you're using the sun to power everything that you've got plugged into your power station. So you were asking me, well, if you've got something plugged in and you've got your solar panel, like, is it gonna be powering? Like, how does that work? Mm -hmm. It's all passed through power. So if I've got my solar panels, the sun is powering anything I've got plugged into my power station. So it's conserving the power that I have on my power station, making it last even longer. So just like if you ever have, you know, people who, now it's, becomes, it's become very popular to yeah. we see all the time solar panels on uh, people's roofs, right? Well, you can literally switch the power, right? You can switch mm -hmm. from just, you know, no, you've got... No, I have, I have that. Oh, oh my God. I'm, yeah. I'm saying, you know how people yeah, have yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, I, I do. Forgot. No, I told you that. You're that one of those we, people. We, t we turned our whole house over to solar. We have solar, pa we, we did that. Because because of every, you know having more control over the power is right. a big deal. I have an EcoFlow. I have solar panels. I I believe me. I want to be prepared. There's nothing worse than being caught not right. prepared. Right. And uh, there's a lot of different metaphors that I could use. Maybe not appropriate for <laughs> yes. for on air. Yes. Okay. But the, the reality <laughs> is that you never want to feel like you know we watched that and we said I don't know is that going to happen to us. 
And that's usually when it happens to you, right? It's like right. Murphy's Law is always that, yeah, no, not us. I think that's us. the last word you said when it happened to us in the studio probably, live. Probably, probably <laughs> you, was. You jinxed us and I then did. it happened because we I, did. I always say, especially when, you know, when we're on air, if it's going to happen, if it can happen, it's going to happen, right? It's not a matter of if, it's a matter of right. when. And that, that saying just rings true all the time because it doesn't matter where mm. you are or how you're yeah. affected, we're all affected differently. You know, I know we've only got six minutes left in this presentation. One of the things I want to show you is all the different things that yep. the EcoFlow Pro, which that this is the Delta Pro, will, and I'd love for you to talk to this yep. because this is really different than all the other ones. We're not talking about cell phones, we're talking about washing machines. This is going to power, know? yeah, this is going to power 99.9% of your home appliances, right? This is going to power everything that you've got in your house, and not just for a little bit. I don't know if we can just hold that graphic for a little bit longer, because I want you to see, that washing machine is three hours. That's 40 hours on your refrigerator. That's 22 hours with your TV. That means you can pretty much watch every single Harry Potter movie that is in existence on one just charge. Your microwave for two and a half hours. A CPAP machine for 51 and a half hours. Hours. These are numbers that we just simply don't ever say mm -hmm. when we're talking about any other power stations. And of course, just a little bit more, and we're not showing you the numbers necessarily, but yeah, this will recharge your electric vehicle. This will power up all of your high wattage appliances like your electric frying pan, your toaster oven, your coffee maker, your electric grill, your air fryer, your hot plate. Think about all of those things. And one of the things that you were talking about was how nice would it be if you had a hot plate that you maybe you got whatever it might be? Could be, uh, you know, Wolfgang Puck, could be Curtis Stone into a hot plate that you picked up here at HSN. And then you have a pot of water that you can now boil and cook food with. Yeah. And if oh, you, yeah. can you do that right now? If you lost power, could you be able to cook food? Could you be able to use, actually, let me come over here. Could you come over to a full-size microwave? Let me put in 25 <laughs> seconds right here. And then say, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and heat up, what was I calling them, chicken nuggies? <laughs> chicken nuggies. My dad was like, don't ever. <laughs> Man, don't ever and say no, that I, on TV I want to tell you, he's like, and by the way, don't ever admit that you like soggy <laughs> chicken nuggets. Uh, I don't care, whatever. Um, use your air fryer, use your microwave, use your high wattage appliances and have hot food. Use a hot plate so you can yeah. literally boil water. And no, one of the best make ways... make coffee. Oh, right, make coffee. <laughs> make a coffee. And heat yourself up from within. So right, be able right. to have hot food to literally warm yourself right, up. So exactly. you can warm up soup. Yeah. Cook cook. If you, right, you know, what we typically do is what we do in emergency. I know I do. I get cans of soup. It's the easiest thing. I get cans of soup. I mm. know that if I don't use them, I, they're going to last me a lot longer. Right. I can put them in my microwave, heat it up, and now it'll warm me Open up in a winter storm. Open the can and put them in a bowl first. The <laughs> Okay. I, I do mother him a lot, but I'm just giving him some tips. For I mean, cooking. I did I did admit to putting in uh, bagel bites for 45 minutes yes, one time. Yes, you did. So. so you make me very concerned. So, your knowledge of microwaving. Okay, look, I was 10 years old. Okay. All right, you know, I forgive you. I've grown slightly since. <laughs> yes. Um, so I just plugged in a light and a fan. 20 hours right now with a light and our fan, and that's not even including the fact that we're still powering up our full size refrigerator in the background. If you know or have ever been in emergency, the first thing that you typically do is you're going to make sure that you've got all the necessities like food and water and that's because that's the things that we need to survive right I mean that's why we go ahead and buy those types of things you have your full-size refrigerator full yeah. full-size freezer and then of course you know one of the things that we were talking about was how nice would it be to not just be able to cool ourselves but mm -hmm. our, the food be able yeah. to cool ourselves with a Actual portable AC unit. Yeah, portable AC unit and a CPAP machine. We talk about things like my daughter and I have asthma using, um, uh, there's an inhaler. It's called nebulizer. a nebulizer. I don't ne know why it went out of my head right now. I have a home nebulizer that yeah. you plug in. I think, what, do you have that? We've talked about this before. This is not, a, I'm not even kidding. <laughs> this, um, this is not a joke. I, in the middle of a hurricane, could not find my inhaler when I was a kid. And I had an asthma attack, and we had to use our neb and I had to use the nebulizer. We had no way of powering it. We had to rush to an emergency clinic in the middle of a hurricane because I couldn't breathe. <laughs> I mean, just well, like when I, I say Murphy's Law, that, well, it always goes bad. Then. But also, those kind of terrifying situations don't help an asthma attack. Let's put it that way. Well, probably not. No. <laughs> you know, I'm just saying because having had asthma attack, my daughter. So there's all sorts of reason. You know, you talk about the terror of not being able to breathe, not being able to breathe when you sleep and things like that. These are things that you need power for in this day and age that you have. I mean, whether you get this EcoFlow or another alternate power source, it's becoming less and less expensive, more and more accessible, and also those power outages and weather emergencies 
sadly are becoming more and more frequent. So here at HSN in this one hour, I know we only have a, two minutes left in the show, we have a deal on the, our most powerful EcoFlow that we've ever had on air. We launched this at about $3,600, and that wasn't that long ago. In this show, we're doing it for $2,500, I'm trying to see exactly what the price is. So you've got 18 months to pay it off, no interest, no fee. It's about $140 a month if you don't get the solar panel, just a couple dollars more a month if you do get the solar panel. The biggest deal really is the one with the solar panel. That's really the biggest deal. It's $750 off, and it's only $150, it's only $100 difference to add the solar panel. So, and it's a 160 watt solar panel that you can be recharging your EcoFlow as your EcoFlow is recharging, is charging your house and everything that you need. Everything from the internet, you need to plug in your modem in order to have Wi-Fi in order to watch the news. A lot of us just use Wi-Fi for yep. all everything nowadays. That's, you need to have power for that. This is gonna be a must have. So I know we have 45 seconds left. You're not gonna be on again with this today, right? I, I, as, as far as I know, I mean, things change. You think Change, minute to know. minute here, minute to minute here but yeah. so maybe but as of right now I will not be back with the Delta Pro today yeah so and, and for the foreseeable future I have nothing scheduled okay well you know we I know we don't have a lot do we still have the case available because I know the case for the EcoFlow okay so there's two left <laughs> there's two can left we put that up can. please what? put the two left <laughs> two up left there. all right so we're going to continue with more live pro programming as you say Marlo's coming up Oh, Amy Morrison's coming up. Okay, so Amy's coming up with uh, Juliana and fashion. So that's coming up right now. Stay tuned for more live television. Hello, everybody. I know it's Monday. We're gonna bring Gotta Watch Thursday fashions to you today. My name's Amy Morrison, and we've got two of the most incredible fall must-have outfits from Juliana. So if you're saying, I don't know how to transition, Amy, from end of summer, kind of mid-fall, it's a difficult time to shop for fashions, right? 